Hey folks, my name is Ryan, welcome back to a new Pokemon card opening. Uh, this is actually only a quick one because I uh, have been wanting to do a celebration opening since I ordered a couple of uh, the celebration products like two Dark Sylvian V box, uh, boxes and a Elite Trainer box, but they've been delayed into oblivion. Luckily, I managed to get myself a singular Pikachu V Union box. It's not a whole lot, so that's why it's a quick video. And I could have, um, you know, kept this one until I had the other products, but I couldn't keep my jitty hands off. So let's just get over to opening it. And since it's just, <coughs> since it's just this, I'm just gonna go straight to opening it right here and see what's in there. Of course, there'll be four pieces of uh, Pikachu in here of the Pikachu Vin Union and the little uh, Professor Barnett at the back. But combined they turn into uh, this card. I still think it's, uh, it would be really nice to have these giant cards while playing V Union cards because it's just such a mess to keep uh, those four together. However, bringing these along is just a pain too, so I can get why. What we're getting is Let's just get it out of there, because I saw some plastic obstructing our way. Uh, and for that, just get them out. <laughs> A bit rough around the edges, but hey. So, what we got over here are four celebration packs, which are only four card packs, but damn, the cards they potentially hold are insane. And besides that, we got still a Darkness Ablaze and a ba uh, Battle Styles. So let's just open these up real quick to see if we can get anything out of here before we go to the juicy part. But for, ah, it's a turn around. Darn. We already know that there's nothing in here, but let's just uh, do it the old fashioned way. Electric Energy, Parasect, Larian, that's a cool art, Glimwood Tangle. Hippopotus, Larvesta, Spinrack, Squawfoot, there's Rowlet, there's a Pin Church, and there's a Reverse, and what the hell? You know, this is weird because last time I got a white coat card with uh, not a V in here, with some other packs I bought at my local card store. But Stunfisk V, how did they. I... That's weird. That's, uh, I'm just gonna get my sleeves because I didn't expect that. Oh, that was not the right there, I think. Yeah, let's, let's just leave this guy up. That's a surprise, to say the least. And let's go over to Battle Styles, then. Let's see if we don't screw this one up, then. God. Ah, oh, no, I screwed it up again. I mean, let's just hope that uh, this one is also a bit screwed up. Grass Energy, Cacturn, the Trapid Skull of Cedra, Yamper with Ball Search and his uh, little ball in his mouth. I like that. Scatterbug, Glaring Mr. Mime, Spoink, Marwell Single Strike, very cool art. There's Phoebe as the reverse, good thing because I actually still need this card. Into Lorantis. I'm gonna do it like the Phoebe. Let's now go to the main show for this short little video. The Generations Pack for the 25th anniversary. I gotta say, it's a pain to get these products because they've been delayed into oblivion, as I've said before. Alright, so what we're gonna do is uh, it seems that the arts are on here. Then there's the code card. I don't know, I believe they're all gonna be white. So let's start us off with Kyogre, with the team Aqua uh, admins on there. Aqua Storm, we're gonna uh, take a bit longer to look at these cards. Mm, it does look cool. I mean, uh, there's something weird about this set and that's that not all cards are playable. And we have Xerneas with Breath of Life, 120 HP, Aurora Horns, cool. 
Then there's the old Venusaur. Oh, that's a good pair. Uh, that's a good hit, actually. And then we got a flying Pikachu V. <laughs> that's a cute one. It actually has fly. But let's put a sleeve onto the Venusaur because I believe that's our hit from this pack. It looks so weird because uh, an old card reprinted as this and you can see that Pokemon really has had its power creep since this is a stage uh, 2 with only 100 HP and needs 4 energies for a 60 power attack. Let it sink in with a Pikachu V that you can immediately throw up and uh, 1 energy deals a 20 damage attack which has a chance to paralyze. Pokemon has gone a long way and I did not... Uh, participate in that whole uh, in that road because I've only started playing this game recently. But hey, at least this Pikachu V is playable, just like the V Union uh, parts. So I'm gonna put it up there. And you know what? Let's just put the other pulls over here. Because that, I mean, every card in this set is really cool, so why not? And they only bring in four cards per pack, so. I'm so careful about opening these packs since there are only four cards in here, so they're not that uh, structurally. God damn it. I don't want to bend the cards, damn it! Oh man, I'm having a real hard time with this. Alright, I'll be right back. I got myself some scissors and I'm just gonna check how far I need to cut. So I'm just gonna cut right above this line over here. So I can easily open up this pack. Yep. Ooh. I mean, we just started off with Kyogre, so why not Bridal? And here's also the code card. Is there a card I'm looking for in here? Yes, uh, the Full Art Chunky Pikachu is a cool one. Let's just look at this. It's the Magma Grunts this time. I do like Rado a lot more than uh, Kyoga. There's Lugia. That brings me back. To 130 HP, looks cool. There's Ho-Ho, wow, we're hitting the doubles. Huh, and I'm gonna put it to the, over here. Then there's Sogaleo with Lily on there, which really cool. Rush in and uh, switch way X Pokemon. It's a cool card, but it's not playable, is it? I need to check which cards are playable and which not, to be honest. But we'll see, we'll see. Then the last card is. Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, this was the last card. Sorry, um, it was Groudon. Lugia, Ho-Oh, and then Solgaleo, indeed. Man, I'm a bit forgetful, it seems. Then let's do this one, just checking if I'm not making any mistakes. It must really hurt for some people to, for me to cut open these packs like this, but I um, have always been terrible at opening packs, and I would rather just open them like this than have them being dented. That is the code card. And there is... Come on, focus please. There we go. There's Cosmark, just crying and not wanting to get in the bag. There's Ivaldal. There's another one of those, uh, of the... Uh, twin legendary Pokemon. The box arts. And there's the Dark Gyarados. Now that's an old school card. Coming back to life with this. It's really cool though. And last, we got a nice little Mew. That's one's looking in. That's a cute one. Alright. Then let's put the old Gyarados into a sleeve. And put it up here. Just having to adjust the camera again. Because I'm, uh, I'm still using my phone camera because... Uh, 
thunderstorm going on outside. Whoa, yeah, the thunderstorm going on outside. But yeah, I'm still using my phone camera because I really don't have anything uh, better. Let's open up our last pack of this little opening. And here you go with the code card. If it focuses. Yeah, there's a code. All right. We're going to start off with Palkia. Into another Cosmog. We actually hit a double this time. All right. Let's ground him again. Wow, another double. But uh, first off, we're going to see what our last card is going to be. It's not... Man. This pack was full of doubles. Well. And Pikachu is at least cute. But with that, I'll probably end this opening. So, uh, thank you all so much for watching. This was a bit of a shorter video, but hey, uh, you'll get more of it next time when I actually receive my delayed products, because at this point, they are, what, delayed by three weeks? It's a pain. But still, thank you all so much for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video. Bye, guys.